next time. All right, thank you, Dorothy. At 7.50 now, the Super Bowl of dog shows is only a couple of weeks away. Today, we'll show you how the stars of the Westminster Dog Show are a lot like the stars of the Super Bowl. <laughs> that and more when Good Day returns. I'm do something nice. John, over to you. Chanel, we got a treat for you now. It's Fox Thursday, and here with us this morning are two of the dogs competing in the Super Bowl of dog shows, the Westminster Kennel Club Show. And Dave Fry, the voice of the competition, is here as well. And he knows all about competing because you, I, we can see the glitter a little <laughs> bit there. That is a Super Bowl ring from the Broncos, right? Previous life. You that's worked right. with the 49ers and the Broncos. Did I did. Jobs. So that makes this time of year my favorite time of year. You get the Super Bowl of dog shows and the Westminster of football. There you go. <laughs> well, let's. we have two champions with us this morning. Tell us about our champs we here. We do. We have a, a Boston Terrier Punch. You can see uh, that's in the non-sporting group, it's not really a terrier, but uh, it's a dog that was developed entirely in this country. And, and with that black and white look, they call it the American Gentleman. It'll be in a tuxedo-like look, just like we will be uh, at Westminster <laughs> on Monday and Tuesday night. Okay. And here we have Boz, uh, Boz? with Alan Kennedy, by the way, from, uh, from Philadelphia. Very good. Boz Welcome. with Michael Pasteri, Pasteri from uh, Aspers, but Boz is a Sky Terrier. And from the terrier group, does all the things that terriers do, chasing varmints and things like that. But the other thing that, that Skye and, and Michael do, they visit the Ronald McDonald House in mm -hmm. Hershey, Pennsylvania, working as a therapy dog team. So it's a great thing. Our dogs are real dogs with real people that do real things during the week and dog shows on the weekends. When you talk Westminster, <coughs> is there one breed that seems to have the advantage when it comes with the judges? Well, we, we seem to get a lot of winners out of the Terrier group, and through the years, the Wire Fox Terrier has had more bests in shows than any other. And I think the Terriers really kind of have this built-in advantage because of what they were bred to do, look for trouble, look for right. varmints. So they're always kind of on their toes, and I think that helps make them stand out in the ring. Okay, well, we want to get ready for the Super Bowl, too, because you're going to compare some of the stars of the Super Bowl <laughs> with breeds of dogs. So we're going to start with Tom Brady, and you say Tom Brady's like the Border Collie. Well, the Border Collie, you know, is the most intelligent dog. <laughs> we think <laughs> yeah. and, and and it's an athletic dog and does a lot of wonderful things but it's a herding dog it moves its flocks up and down the field just like Tom Brady does and we checked all four ankles are just fine for Sunday <laughs> well and he's got a supermodel girlfriend too <laughs> there you go. Eli Manning German Shepherd why is that well I think Eli's a little more uh, has the image of being a little more even in his temperament and, and intelligent to his approach he really is the alpha dog but goes about his business in a quiet way does he have an older brother named Peyton who's already got one, too? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. He probably does, working the flocks on the other side. This is one I'm very interested in, Randy Moss. Randy Moss. I, Afghan hound, is, is in my mind, represents Randy Moss. And Afghans were my breed for 30 years, but they're elegant and athletic and fast, and they run their prey down. And, and in Randy's case, they even kind of share that same elegant hairstyle. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> and we don't want to forget about the Giants' Plaxico Burris, who's already come out and said, hey, we're going to win 23-17. You've got him with the Greyhound. Well, the Greyhound, of course, is a great athletic dog, fast, uh, long legs, lean, deep chest, and can run like the wind. And that's the way I see Plaxico. Is Maybe there he one? can make that 23-17 stick. Well, who's got the advantage then when you're looking at the breeds in the well, Super Bowl? Well, I think overall the Giants have the advantage really? just with that name. You know, they're Giants. Yeah. And we, the Giant dogs have their way more often than not. We'll see what happens. But thank you all for coming in. And we don't want to forget the Westminster Dog Show. Westminster Kennel Club, uh, Monday and Tuesday, February 11th and 12th on USA Network. We'll definitely be watching. Thank you so much for coming thank in. Thank you, John. And we'll be 